Hello, my friends. I have a new poem for you. You know the days when you're better left alone? And if you happen to be in a dark corner in a dark room, all the better for you and everyone else? The days when not even sugar or a stiff drink or your drug of choice makes a shred of difference in the landscape of sorrow? Or is it rage or fear? Whatever your flavor of closing down, curling up, slamming shut, however you refuse to shift, deny the light that just wants to cast a splash of hope across your cheek. You know the days when all you do is sit and stare, can't move your face to anything but slack. Lack everywhere, lack of hope, money, motivation, mojo. Doesn't matter how far I've traveled down any spiritual path, equanimity, poise, objectivity, flung out the window at dawn. This life is a ride, people. Anyone who preaches from a pulpit and refuses to acknowledge the unstoppable raging current is not to be trusted. The ones to listen to have a wild compassion in their eyes that comes from riding that current on a makeshift raft crafted from loss and resurrection. Best thing to do with a day like this, as far as I can tell, is muster up a nod to it. A generous nod to the stranger walking through from parts unknown. If you can find the words or even just lift your head, invite him in for coffee black. Ask him why he's come, what he hopes to find here in this wild, wild wilderness. Listen up. He'll mumble, shed a tear. He won't make sense. Listen closely. Say your farewells and watch him walk into a fiery sunset. Watch him burn at the center, swallowed by the flames. Lay your head on your pillow and exhale. Give it away, the stranger, the day, all of it. Die into the darkness that will swallow your pain with its fierce love. Set down your honorable load. Then trust this. Morning light will touch your cheek. You need only turn ever so slightly towards it. <laughs>